everybody, it's Miss Trinisha. This week we're back with some more sign language. I decided today that I wanted to do something a little bit differently. So along with our new words and letters of the alphabet that we're going to learn, I'm also going to teach you a couple of common phrases in sign language. So the first one is I'm learning to sign. So for my, we know that we used our whole hand, but for I or me, we are just going to use our pointer finger to point to ourselves. So that's I'm. And then for learning, it's very similar. It kind of reminds me of student. And when we learn to say student, we learn that we keep one palm flat and then we use our other hand as if we're picking something up and dropping it. So it's kind of a similar motion, but instead of dropping it, we're going to pick something up and bring it to our brain. So that's learning. And then for sign, we are just going to take our two pointer fingers and then kind of move them in a circular motion. So when we put it all together, we have I'm learning to sign. Okay, on to our words as usual. Today we are going to learn how to say drive, car, to, and leave. Drive and car are super similar, so that's why we're learning a little extra word in there this week. So to say drive, we are going to act like our hands are on a steering wheel, and we are going to kind of move our body along with it. So that's drive, and the difference between drive and car is for car, we are going to keep our body still and just move our hands. So we have drive and car. So for two, we're going to take our pointer fingers and leave one where it is and just bring the other one to meet it. So that's two. And to say leave, we're going to kind of act as if our hands are on a hot stove and then pull them away. So that's leave. Now to move on to our alphabet. So today the letters that we are going to learn are J, K, and L. So let's review what we know of the alphabet so far. So we know A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. So now we're here at I and all we're going to do with our pinky to make a J is literally just trace a J. So we have our pinky and we're going to make it in like the shape of a hook, just like a J is. So that's J. For K, we are going to hold up our two fingers, kind of like a bunny, but then we're going to put our thumb right in between them. So that's K. And then for L, all we do is make an L with our pointer finger and our thumb. So that's L. So let's put everything together. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. To practice even more, you can also practice on your other hand, which is usually your non-dominant hand or the hand that you don't write with. So let's practice with that hand. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. It's a little challenge for you. See if you can do it on one hand and then the other. You can even try both hands together if you would like. In last week's video, I signed a sentence, so I'll go ahead and put the answer to that for you now. And now I'll go ahead and sign this week's sentence. One more time. So see if you know what I am signing to you and you can send me an email or a message on Class Dojo to let me know what you think. I want to give a quick shout out to my students who are watching my videos. We did a live Zoom meeting this past week and I was able to see them practicing. So it's awesome to know that they are watching these videos and learning from it. So shout out to all of you. I miss you so much and I can't wait to see you on Zoom again next week. I hope you have a fantastic week and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.